guys welcome back to my channel so today I am here with the first of two Dollar Tree hauls I have been holding on to some stuff for a while so now it's so big that I can't put it all in one haul or you guys will get super bored and I don't want you to get super bored so I am going to start off the first one of these two hauls with probably one of the coolest things I've ever found at Dollar Tree and that is these huge if you can read that on there stackable three-tier planter so I actually got two of these and what they are is they look like this and you fit them on top of each other so you can make like there is a little picture on the tag you're probably not gonna be able to see it but they show you like what you can do so my thing that I want to do with these is strawberries because strawberries like to kind of grow and go crazy so I thought that would be cool if I did like one plant in each like in each of the things and then turn it and that way we would be able to do six plants together so super cool and they do have the little um drainage holes on the bottom you just have to punch them out and then once you do that you are in business so yeah so far up here all the dollar trees that i kind of circulate to i've only seen these at one so if you see them, I would definitely grab some because I know they're going to go fast. So the next thing, this is kind of a wish list item. Um, I really want the black one with the lemons that says start a fresh start or something each day. But this was the only one I was able to find. But it's okay because it matches. It's going in my kids' bathroom. Matches their bathroom. It says soak your troubles away the cute little old-fashioned tub on there and these are the nice um 100 cotton thick hand towels so that's super cool they had this one and they had the one that said home is where the shower is and i just thought that was weird i don't i don't know i thought that was weird <laughs> so i didn't get that one so the next thing these are by aroma aroma guru and um if you have watched dollar tree hauls i'm sure you have seen this brand hauled like crazy but now they have them in little um it's the like brown tinted glass bottles with the dropper so i'm actually gonna open this because i want to see So it does say not for use in a diffuser. So just in case you were thinking you were going to get these and just dump them into your diffuser. So it does have the little squid. Mm, I can smell it already. So I got two of the lavender because we go through lavender like crazy in our house. So mm, that smells so good. So it is, it's a glass. Maybe it'll focus. It's a glass dropper. And the carrier oil that they mix with is almond oil, sweet almond oil. Um, but it's, I mean, this stuff is potent. It is amazing. I put this on my kids' feet at night. I'll just kind of like give them like a little foot massage when I'm putting them to bed. And they both love it. Along with the little planters that I picked up, I picked up some of these Tomato Rocket. It's an as seen on TV product. Um, you just plant it, water it, it, says it can grow up to 10 pounds of tomatoes. So, I don't know. Does anybody ever use these? Do they work? I feel like they might be at Dollar Tree because they don't work very well, but we'll see. We'll see what they do. A couple new, well, new to me, craft items. I haven't seen the rub on transfers anywhere and I found some finally. So these are by Crafter Square and this one has, um, I think that's supposed to be a hummingbird, which is what made me want to buy this because hummingbirds are my favorite. 
So it's got the little hummingbird guy, a bunch of flowers. It's got unicorns, swans. I don't know what that is. Wolves, maybe. I just thought these were really pretty. They're just kind of like woodland creatures, I guess. Fish. Not sure what I'm going to do with them, but I'll probably figure out something. Something creative to do with those. Maybe like pocket letters. Has anybody ever tried those on pocket letters? Do they rub onto plastic? That is something I'm going to try. This was kind of an impulse buy. I really don't do much with these, but these are the long ones. And you get 10 of them in here. Again, by Crafter Square, these are the wooden dowels. So normally Dollar Tree has the ones that are half this size, but they had some packs of the long ones. So you never know. It, I'm gonna get the Valentine's Day stuff out of the way. I kind of have a lot of it this time. Um, I got these, these are felt stickers. So Dollar Tree has these for every holiday pretty much. You just peel off the little white thing on the back. These are cute little hearts that look like they have stitching on them and then they each have a heart-shaped gem in the middle. So you get 26 of them in here, that's awesome. That's a good deal. These will be perfect for pocket letters, for if I do decide to send out any Valentine cards, I can stick these on there anything like that. Probably pocket letters. I really, really, really want to do a Valentine's Day pocket letter. So if you are someone who is interested and wants to receive a pocket letter, leave me a comment, send me an email, do something so that I know so I can get one going. So another thing I grabbed were these color your own ornaments. So you get five of them in here and they just look like the heart with the arrow through it. And you get the little jute twine to hang them up because I'm gonna try to make like some kind of like banner or something out of these for Valentine's Day. I don't go all out decorating for Valentine's Day, but I like to have like, maybe just like a little banner. I like to do the coffee bar with Valentine, you know. Um, these are by New Color. So you get four makeup sponges and actually looking at it, I think each one rips in half. So really, you get eight makeup sponges. But I got these, see, cause each one has, I'm not gonna open it because this is actually going in my little goodie bag for my daughter that I'm putting together. But these are, it is distributed by Greenbrier. So new color is, it was with all of the color mate stuff that they have. So I'm kind of thinking it's something along the lines of the color mate stuff. Speaking of kiddo valentines, I picked up a two pack of these Voila brand bags. So this one just says happy valentines day with the little hearts. And this one is just striped with a plain pink heart. I might actually embellish this one because it's kind of boring compared to this one. I don't want anybody to feel left out because I'll probably use this one for my son and then I'll use this one for Jenna, my daughter. So, so cute. I also grabbed this tissue paper for wrapping their gifts. So there's six sheets in here. So I'm guessing you get three red and three of. This is what sucked me in on these, the pretty gold foil hearts. I love this. So cute for Valentine gifts. I found a different, so if you had seen, I think it was my last haul, the one that I did vlog style, um, I had hauled one of these, the Valentine skateboards, and this one is actually, these are different patterns. So I'm going to hang on to these and see if Jackson wants to give these maybe to like his closest friends, because he already took the other ones apart, and he actually threw away the Valentine cards because he didn't know that they were part of it and he has just been playing with the mini skateboards. I picked up one of these. I pick these up every year. I hate, 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 cannot stress hate enough, the conversation hearts. I think they are disgusting. But that's just my opinion. I hate those. I hate Neko wafers. I hate any of those like chalky, nasty candies like that. <laughs> 
but Smarties. I love Smarties. And they have the Smarty Conversation Hearts. So I picked up a pack of these. Actually, we picked up two. Jenna's going to give some to her friends. But these are, I'm going to stick one in each of the kiddos' bags and then I'll hang on to the other ones, you know, because Smarties don't stick around long here. I don't know if they've always had these and I just don't look at them because they're just containers and I don't need more containers but they have 10 little heart containers so this one just has like the little conversation hearts all over it and it's just gold inside and yeah I just got this actually just to display with my valentine decor so really cute so this next thing when I show it, she's going to know exactly who it's for. <laughs> I hope at least. Well, I have two things for her actually. So anyone, anyone care to take a stab at who this is for? Besties. It's just one of these cute little books that they have at Dollar Tree that has like little, little friendship quotes inside. So cute. And the puppy on the front is just adorable. So you know who you are and you know who that's for. These are also for that same person. <laughs> Three piece. These are the metal decor words. So they say love, XOXO, and Valentine. I do not do as many DIYs as Bonnie does. And I found these for her. So last thing in the valentine stuff are these cute little stickers there's 48 of them in here they do have like the gold foil detail so it says heart there's stripes there's hearts and polka dots there's swirlies it says sweet so i got these for valentine cards and for again that valentine pocket letter so let me know again comment down below if you would like to do some kind of valentine pocket letter swap or something also the plaid or the gingham or whatever you want to call it it's so cute okay so that's it for valentine's this is super boring but one of my dollar trees had the mega my size so you get 210 sheets so i picked up two of these we have reptiles so we go through paper towels like crazy because that's one of the easiest cheapest beddings to have them on is just plain old paper towels and you just crumple them up throw them away and then put fresh ones in there I found another one of these maze books if you guys remember i hauled one around christmas that actually went into jackson's stocking and he loves it he loves doing mazes but this one is Spongebob, so I'm going to put this one in his little Valentine goodie bag. To make sure I put that somewhere where he's not going to see it. I just have to say, it is. It's super hard shopping at Dollar Tree when there's so much stuff that my kids love. And they're always with me when I'm there, so I have to, like, hide it. Like, does anybody else do that? I have to, like, hide it under other things so that they don't see it. And then sometimes they still end up seeing it. And it's like, ugh. So this is another Valentine gift. This is by DC and it is Hot Wheels. New for 2019. But it is a Batmobile. It's kind of, um. I don't know what the word I'm thinking is like die cast or whatever. So if you can see it, it's kind of like a silvery, like gunmetal kind of gray. Super cool. Oh, there's more Valentines in here. Oh my gosh. So these little, mm, I'll show you guys these first because they're smaller. So I picked up these lashes. They had little sets of these in with the Valentine stuff. I picked these up just to kind of play around with. I need to get better about or I need to teach myself, I guess, how to apply um, fake eyelashes. So if it's a dollar and I mess them up and have to throw them away, it's not that big of a deal. Because at Walmart, 
eyelashes are expensive. Okay, so I'm looking at the time on this video and it is starting to get a little long. So the last thing I'm going to show you guys is this little lip balm, which is so cute and I freaking love the packaging. So it's called Cherry Bombshell and they had another one that was Strawberry Shake. I don't really like strawberry flavored anything. These are by Remy Rose. So if you remember... A couple hauls ago, I hauled some lipstick that was Remy Rose, and um, I need to do a review on all the beauty products that I've been using and stuff. I have all the packages. I keep the packages, but I just haven't done a review yet. Um, so this is, I wanted to get it and get it out and see what it looks like. So you just unscrew it? Okay, so it's like... Um, uh, 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 what's it called? EOS? EOS? Whatever. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. Oh, friends. It will turn your lips red. Not sure if that's something, but... Oh my gosh, it's so, like... Smooth, and it tastes so good. Like, it's, like, definitely that, like, artificial cherry taste, but... It tastes like cherry chapstick, and I love cherry chapstick. It's one of those weird things. So, yeah, if you guys get these in your Dollar Trees, the, I'm sure the Strawberry Shake one is good if you like that artificial strawberry flavor. I just don't. So, yeah. So, that's it for this part of the haul. I will see you guys in the next haul, and make sure you hit that like button. Give me a big thumbs up. And if you aren't subscribed, I would love it if you would subscribe if you like what you see. So I will see you guys in my next haul in part two. Bye guys.